The base of the ZG mounts to any 5 8 pin, so it can be quickly moved between shooting modes. For this scene, we are starting out on the deck to achieve a low wide shot. Now we drop the ZG onto a combo stand and send it skyward. The operator can then stand on an adjacent ladder and operate comfortably and safely, while still maintaining the look and feel of handheld shooting. Using the optional Mitchell adapter accessory, the ZG can mount to any compatible platform, such as this Fisher 10 dolly on track. The operator has full control of the frame, as if shooting from a conventional head. By inverting the Mitchell adapter, we can hang the ZG underslung from a jib arm. This allows for unique hybrid shots, where we can combine a smooth reveal with a slight agitation in the frame to maintain energy. Here, we've combined the dolly with a Steadicam vehicle mount. We are now able to roll on uneven ground without bumps making the sideways adjustment more subtle. Transferring the vehicle mount over to the Patriot car, the operator can dial in the amount of extra movement in the frame to make it more exciting. And via the Steadicam arm, can adjust the height of the camera within a roughly two and a half foot range. As an alternative to the Steadicam arm, the optional shovel handle can be combined with the undersling kit to allow the ZG to be hung from above on a latex shock cord. The three-axis isolation of the ZG removes the pendular motion typical of a suspended rig. Now, let's watch these scenes in final form. <laughs> 